Alright everyone, I'm Ryers and welcome back to Elden Ring. Let's keep going. So, let's level up our vitality to 40 here. That should be a good number for now at least. Start le leveling other things. Hi kitty. Alright, so let's head up into Noxella proper. take care of these guys. Not quite within range, okay. I didn't hit it? Okay. Weird. Okay. More of them. I want to get these guys out of this room. Okay, yeah, that does not work very well. That was in the back. Okay. Ghost Club for Pickers Bill Blaring 2. Is that the, uh, like, 4, 5, and 6 one, maybe? Or 4, 5? That is 4, 5, and 6. That's nice. Archer Ashes. Groups of archers who once belonged to the Holland Hawks, a band of soldiers that once explored the Eternal City. Their arrows are imbued with cold ghost flame. Although their methods are somewhat crude, but they work well as a squadron, firing a hail of arrows in unison at the sound of a war cry. Interesting.
Thought you could get me, huh? I didn't, only because I thought that this was a snail for some reason. Not sure why. Okay, no more there. We could go in here. Uh, yeah, let's go in here. One? Just the one. Okay. See that boulder over there. It looks like it's coming my way. Hi. Unlocked. The larval tier, okay. There's a stone sword key door up here. I don't. Uh, I'm not gonna risk that message. Takes one key, we have plenty of them. Can't target these guys? Oh, because the message is on my on my screen. That yeah, okay. Okay. Ouch. I don't like it th We're fighting two of these guys at once. Thankfully they can stagger pretty easily. Okay. Maiden and Swordstress puppets. Interesting. An old puppet crafted in the Eternal City. He used to summon the spirits of a Night Maiden and a Swordstress. Now these sisters, members of a cold blooded race who wield flowing weapons, became puppets of their own volition. Interesting. What's out here? Just a good view, I guess? I guess so, okay. Alright, I guess maybe just way back down. Jump over the railing. Yeah, okay. Let's go to the right first. See what's in here. It's kind of ominous in there. I 
Hey, kitty. Oh, that's just a ball. I thought it was going to be a boss f for a second. A fancy looking item. Great ghost gold wart, nice. Hm. Yeah, we checked over here already, yeah. Another trap, maybe. I do see a ball up there. And a lot of slimes. Thankfully, they're all electric, so they're all going to die. Right? Okay, now they are. Feels like they're dropping en endlessly in here. Weird. Nope, oh, okay, there, there, there's the ball. Throw a knife at that, at the orb. Too horrible. This is ball just uh, afraid of the slimes, I guess. Ow. Okay, the jumping attack is dangerous. That's risky. Larval tier. Okay. 
I'm just gonna use Beast of Vitality to recover health here. That looks like an important building over there. Like a boss, potentially. So, uh, I'm not gonna go out there just yet. I'll save that for later. I'm gonna go this way instead. Centipede, okay. Alright, well I guess that doesn't really lead much of anywhere, does it? There's still this, um... That over there, I guess that leads after that building, okay. Uh -oh, I didn't pick up this item, I picked up the centipede instead. All right. Well, let's head to the big, the big scary building over here. I do have seven flasks. Should hopefully be enough. Okay, this beetle is up here. Yes. Okay. Maybe not, though. Okay. Maybe it's just a building. It still looks ominous. Uh, I'm gonna bring up the timer just in case. Those are mimics, okay. That's uh, that's okay though. You're just normal mimics, uh, normal mimics, I guess. Yeah. Okay, you are pretty strong though. I think it's a boss. Turn the timer off. No, we're good. Okay. have a special item in here. M Moon of Noxtella. Is that a talisman? It is. Increases memory slots by two. Okay. A legendary talisman is a a treasure of Noxtella, the eternal city, increases memory slots. This talisman re re represents the lost bl black moon. The moon of Noxtella was the guide of countless stars. Interesting. I saw a message or a lore somewhere that said Ronnie should fear the black moon. So I'm curious what that is exactly. 
Ya. Guess we head down here. As soon as it goes down. Yep, okay. Down to the golden seed. Yep. Excellent. Ah, oh, calmness. Now, how many of those do we have now? Two. Okay. Well, we also have a sacred tier we can use. I forgot to actually use that. I think that might be it for down here then. So we explored. No, we didn't explore that section though. Or did we? I'll put a marker down there just to uh, take a look. Although we can't really get back up now. Have we been up there? Probably have, right? I don't see why we wouldn't have been. Yeah, we have. That's... yeah. I remember going across there. Okay. So, I think that's it for this area, besides the Lake of Rot, obviously. Which is its own area, which I might actually try to get through. But, uh, first... I'm going to head... <coughs> to head... <coughs> Sorry about that. Lake of Rot is right below Ray Lucaria, okay. I'm going to head back to the year the round table to upgrade things. I'm also going to talk to Nefeli if she's still here. I believe she was down this side. Okay, you're still there. Father has now. Okay, I'm try talking to Gideon before I leave. See if there's any updates on that. Well, where have you? I took you for no matter. Lay out your arm. All right, strength and armament plus seven and plus eight. All right, that's a lot of damage now. Could upgrade the, the mimic tier to plus 10, I believe. That's expensive. Yeah, I can. It just takes a lot of runes. Okay, so I need about 11,000 more. I got plenty of these. Uh, well, one of those is 5,000. Okay. I'll use one more of those. And... I guess one of these. Sure, that works. Greeting, do you have a spit? A minute here, plus ten. Alright. Anything new with you? Would you like the blessing? Would you like to be? No, okay. To you. All right, let's use the sacred tier. 
And to add charge, we need four golden seeds. Okay. Uh, I think we're good there. Are you still not feeling well? Yeah, okay. Alright. Well, I guess, uh... Yeah, let's talk to Gideon first, see if he has anything to say about, uh, about the potion. Journey to the cap the two fingers. You may be our Nope, okay. Alright. Let's attempt the cave or, or the lake of rot, then. Okay, what was that? on the map as well. Down there. Yeah, th that's a unique area down there. Which looks like that leads up to that. Okay. Interesting. So I wonder if we have to get there from here then, maybe. Okay, well, let's, uh, do I have any, anything that boosts rot resistance? Or can I craft anything that boosts rot resistance? I mean, immunity? I mean, that, that would work. Yeah, okay. So I guess um, I'll head around to the left, check out these two spots. Ooh, that's a purple item right there. All right. Hey, butterfly. I've got plenty of, of uh, healing. Okay. Take down a little bit. Or cleansing it then. Hi. Y you're here now too? Oh boy. Okay. Joy. Dropped a purple item? Yeah, I guess it did. Alright, I'm gonna have my cerulean flask here. Uh, guess I can try to make it over to there. the only guy in here? Alright, I'm gonna wait this out, unless I can craft the... No, I can't craft the rot ones. This looks like just a normal guy.
Okay, that gave some flasks back. Nice. That gave the Cerulean one back, too. Uh, let me try to shoot this guy with an arrow. Try to get his attention to come over here. Hey, you. Really? Okay. Okay, that hit him. Come on. Don't do that. Come on. Head over here. Man. Alright, never mind that. Anything special about this, or no? Well, maybe. Yes, that is definitely special. Immunizing Horn Charm plus one. Greatly raises immunity. How much? By quite a bit. Okay. Yeah, let's put that on. Um, on this here. Oh yeah. And I gotta wait for it to drain. So I'll uh, see you guys in a few seconds, I guess. <laughs> okay. I guess our next stop would be that little rock there. Probably just heal through it. <clears throat> and then cure it when I get there. Oh, yeah, that's much easier. That's a boss. Very clearly, that's a boss. Uh, and it gave us platforms, at least, to, uh... No, 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 no! Well, I guess we're going in. Hi. Right? This is a boss? Yep, okay. Damage. Oh boy, that's a lot of damage. Ow, that that is also a lot of damage. Okay, please come over here so I can hit you. I have to get rotted, thank you. Ow. Yikes. 
out of that, please. Right. Okay. Well, the button's pressed now, I guess, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Those platforms are still there, right? I would hope so. There's more of those. Hmm. Okay. Isn't that handy? Hot grease, okay. Yeah. And rot it, yeah, of course. I need soap to clean myself. There it is. There's an item over there, but let's grab this first. Let me grab this item. And that item too, I suppose. Wrong button, that's fine. That key bolts. Let's go back over to that. Eh, might as well just go over here. Really? Really? <clears throat> Okay, those platforms do stay, thankfully. Um, 
I'm gonna we'll wait here again while it drains. So I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, I think that's good enough. Let's try running across to here. Nice. It looks like another pressure plate. Uh, let me... Okay, I can't do that yet, so let's just use this. Exactly sure what the point of that is, but there's another one over there. I think, right there. I'm trying to m m m m mark it here. All right, that's that's close enough. It needs to be more to the south, or more to the uh, east, I guess. There. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Alright, I guess let's try to get to the boss again. I do have a few of those. I put that on my hot bar here. Alright, let's make a run for it now. Alright, I'm going to use one of these. Take my shield out. Grab my runes. Say, so grab my runes. There we go. Take my time with this. That hurts a lot. Heal up again. Yeah. Okay. Slam. That might be it, actually. Yep, 
Okay. Too bad. Uh, the Dragon Scale Blade. Let's see what kind of weapon that is. It's a katana. Okay. A weapon made by sh sharpening a gravel stone scale. Thought to be the source of ancient dragon immortality into an unclouded blade. Alas, the Dragonkin soldiers never attained immortality and perished as decrepit, pale imitations of their skyborn kin. A, 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 a ice lightning sword. Call on a bolt of ice lightning into the blade and bring it down upon a foe. The effect will persist for a while. Okay. That looks cool. Nice. That drained a lot of my uh, FP. I didn't re recover my uh, flasks. Okay. So let's run for it. Jump. Could use a warming stone if I have to. Okay, we've been to this one. This is the one that made the platforms, right? Yeah, okay. I still have these, so... Might as well use one here. I'll use a warming stone. It costs FP though. Uh, hmm. Is there really nothing else that heals me? Guess not. Okay. Besides, uh, you know, my my talisman. I do want to get over there though. I've got one, maybe two uses of Flame Cleanse. We have 29 stand, or FP, and Flame Cleanse me takes uh, 14. So I, I, I barely have enough to, for two casts. That should be good enough, I think. Till I get over here first. Okay, then I'm gonna heal up my last flask. Step on this. Oh, okay. That works for me. That 
light is already down? Yeah. Okay. Guess we explore uh, up on top of here then. Oh boy. Alright, fine. Uh, let me use this here real quick. Thankfully, you're e very easy to stagger. Yeah, okay. Not a problem. Alabaster Lord's Sword. It's a great sword. 18 intelligence. Great sword forged from a blue-white meteoric, meteoric ore. The blade con conceals gravity manip manipulating magic. A weapon unique to the alabaster lords, a race of ancients with skin of stone who were said to have risen to life when meteors struck long ago. Press the armament into the ground to create a gravity well. <laughs> in addition to, to dealing damage, this attack pulls enemies in. Has a greater effect, a greater area of effect than gravitas. Okay. Ooh, that's nice. Also, that's that one, yeah. I wonder if there's a, um, a talisman that restores a a FP over time. Because that would be neat. Okay, nothing else up here. Doesn't look like it, okay. I guess we head into that. Oh, hopefully there's a, uh, a grace in there or something. Yeah, okay. It looks like we have to drop down and go around, unfortunately. That's gonna be a pain. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Well, I've got five boluses left. But that's it. I don't have any other, like, health re re recovery things. Really, there's one of those there. Let me craft more darts. Nope, that did not work. Okay. I'll come back for that later. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Hopefully there's not more required rot in here. Although it's possible there might be. No, maybe not. Okay. Oh, there's a grace. Nice. Ah, oh. that's that's very nice. Grand Cloister. <sighs> Alright, we have a lot of runes. We can level twice. Let's level... Hmm, I guess... Strength and Dex? Hmm. I don't really need it, I don't think. Do Endurance. Hmm. Could do Faith, maybe. I guess, sure. Okay. Well, we have all our stuff back now, thankfully.
Grand Cloister. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, I have to check, even though I know it's not, yeah. So we go across. There's a lot of those uh, shrimp things down there. But they're not usually too bad. I just don't know how we get down from here. Safely. Yeah, that doesn't look that doesn't look doable, but I can try it. Nope. Okay. Hmm. I guess we can go down this way. So I guess let me grab my runes. looks like it might lead somewhere. Maybe? Hmm. How the hell do we get down there? Still can't use Torrent. So this is clearly a way to go, but, uh, okay, that's how. <laughs> and then we drop down to here, and then down to here, okay. go back here uh, see if we can actually I want to see if we can get this guy okay this guy's coming over here to see me that's good Come on.
joy. Okay, let's uh, not be there right now. Can you come over here, please? Thank you. Ouch. Very painful. Somehow that didn't hit me. Okay, sure. damage, okay. Very nice. And we got some a golden seed from that too, nice, okay. Fantastic. Alright, now that we did that, we can go over here, grab these items. Stone, 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 okay. <laughs> All right, let's head this way then. These guys here. Help back, please. Thank you. Before we go in there, let's check over here. A 
Okay, that is the the pool that I thought was a boss arena. And that's just the edge of the map, I guess. Okay. So then, what's in this building? An elevator? Mm, probably not. A sending gate? Maybe. chest, okay. Scorpion's Stinger. Dagger. Causes rot buildup, that's nice. D dagger fashioned from a great scorpion's tail, glistening with scarlet rot. A ceremonial tool used by heretics, crafted from the relic of a sealed outer god. Alright. So I guess that's it for down here, unless there's maybe that up there, but maybe. That look that just looks like a, a decoration on the map or something. Okay, well I guess if I find anything on the way back to the grace I'll let you know. I don't even think I can get back to the grace from here. Let's see, maybe I can. No, that that's just a drop down. Okay. I don't think there's anywhere else to go then. Yeah, okay. Well, I guess, uh... I think that might be it for... For, uh, Noxtella. So there was a boss in the lake. Boss right there. Okay, well, I still don't know how to get down to uh, that s section, which will, would be nice to know, because I want to get up there. That would be nice to get to. That lines up exactly with that. Although maybe that just leads from the top into this area. That's, that's probably more likely. I wonder if one of the Belfry places takes us there. Well, I'll head here. Since we have all three keys. But uh, I'm going to leave this episode here for now. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.